So death is one of the iconic fantasy subjects that's been portrayed in myths and legends throughout the ages and, and get, death is often shown as a grim reaper which is a skeleton in a hood with a scythe and it can be quite a scary image of uh, like the bringer of doom but also um, death and the angel of death is, 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 is something that comes to people at the end of their life and guides their soul into the next world so in that respect that's it's kind of a nice thing it, it, it shows that there is something after we die and that that character is there to, to guide us on to the next world. My job as a fantasy artist, I feel, is to take some of these iconic subjects and show them to the world in a way that they perhaps haven't been seen before, um, to put them in a picture that creates a little bit of a story. So um, this is a picture called Dance with Death, uh, where the death angel is dancing with the beautiful girl. So it's a contrast between the end of life and the beginning of life. It's one of the things with life that with, without death, there isn't true life. It's that seize the day kind of sentiment that, that can be quite meaningful. Now, in, in this piece is called Lifeblood. And for this one, I thought it would be interesting to depict a female reaper. So here, um, it's a lady in white. Behind her is a swirl of skulls and roses, which symbolizes the eternal um, movement from death to life. Life grows out of death, death comes from life. So this product is a sand timer and I felt one of the perfect accompaniments for a sand timer would be the reaper because after all the sand timer is a measure of time and there is a grim reaper that um, when you turn it over there the white sand trickles down which is representing the soul. Uh, it was quite an interesting design challenge with these because I wanted to do um, a composition that would work when you're looking at it upright but it would also provide the base when it's turned the other way up so in this one the base is provided it's like a tripod provided by the side and his shoulder and his head so I, I really like the job that they did on that sculpture I think I think it looks really cool